What's up folks, welcome back, I'm DailyFix. Uh, today we're going to be continuing with our Italy campaign. So, there's a lot of things that we could do. Could we just turn off those hints, that's so annoying. Um, but I'm going to be reserving my manpower. Um, we are currently, I believe, sending some troops over there, are we not? I think so, yeah, there we go. Um, so we'll definitely use these to attack the rebels. And I can't drill them in here, which is a shame. I wish that Tunis could actually do this himself, but he can't. Ah, oh well. What will we do? What will we do? Um, I will probably have Russia do the majority of this war himself. What I will do is just siege the, uh, the capitals down who are nearest to me. So we don't have to deal with any of those. Uh, I think he, once he pieces out Austria, that's about it for us. There is no real need to stay in this war then. So that will all go. I still need to do all of these, uh, these buttons. The hints I could probably turn off like this. There we go. That, that saves me a lot of headache. Also, I, I'm aware of the echo in this room. And in the future, I will do something about it, but I can't do it right now. So bear with me, okay? Let's unpause and continue. Uh, discovered that Lubeck is cancelled military access. Sure, do it. Whatever. It's fine. I don't care. Uh, we're sending him over here. And we'll go deal with those guys. Actually, we'll uh, transport you. Over there. I'm actually not that afraid of the armies currently. Even though we are getting a negative two here. Uh, we have way more morale. And we will just win this in sheer numbers. There we go. What's going on over here? Apparently there were two fights. that completely missed them. <laughs> How about that? Uh, agenda of the diets. Manufactory, Napoli have a manufactory. There's actually two for manufactory. A base tax and manpower in Napoli. I'll go for the factory in Napoli. Let's see. Uh, we'll have the money shortly. Uh, we're building a lot of courthouses. I actually did a, do, I queued up a few off cam as well. And I've destroyed the majority of the churches, so we don't have to worry about that. Oh yeah, this this is this is uh, a very very easy war. We'll siege him down. We we don't have to do anything. They they just lost the majority of their troops. Can't wait until we actually have annexed. Tunis, because wow, this they they really take a sweet time. Go over there. And march all the way over there. Oh. 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 Seriously? I... Now I feel dumb. <laughs> okay, that's great. The Fuenia is sending in troops. Will you be back? Okay, let's send you over here. So we can actually reinforce. Golden arrow over there. Hungary is being sieged down. Come on, take these towns right now. Before, now they're going to be annoying. Uh, send a letter to Angelica of Ethiopia asking her for manpower. Yeah, we'll do it. And there we go. I think they could probably piece out Austria. 61. Come on, man. You can do it. We also need to develop. Four and a half years is just too much. Let's go. We were doing development in the uh, lower regions over here. Uh, developed subjects. Okay. So we need five still. So these ones are 25. This one as well. It's three. Mm, X 
Actually, we have four. This one counts as well. Do we have anything but mountains or hills? Okay. That's 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 too bad. That that really is too bad. We'll uh do something like this. There we go. That should be the mission. And we will get for twenty years local unrest negative two and the local tax modifier plus ten. Sure, we'll take it. Continue the renaissance. Interesting. We need universities. I don't think I can build those yet. Uh, where's the menu again? Uh, here. Yeah, no, we can't. We need um, level 17 in technology. Okay, with you done... He's locked in, so we'll definitely take that fight. Uh-oh. Let's reinforce. Let's reinforce. It's farmland, so... Oh, well. That's going to be a big-ass fight, though. Did not mean to do that. He's already locked in, so he's committed. Will he do this? Oh, we got 5,000 manpower. Well done, dude. Are we going to make this in time? I don't think so. Let's not waste our troops here even more, then. Uh, Russia is already just pouring in. Can we pull you back? Yeah, we can. There we go. And you go over there. You head on over there. Stay in our own lands. And uh, we're fighting the rebels. And we, of course we won. Let's pull these guys back. We uh, we could use the uh, the manpower. Let's not do these fights again. Because that just felt... Really, really dumb. Just peace out Austria, Russia. You can do this. Actually, he's on high, so you won't be doing it. We'll start uh, working our way down. Or actually, up. And hopefully they will peace out Austria then. Just keep them together. So he knows that we can actually reinforce if we need to. Oh, Trent is over here. I completely forgot about you, dude. You go ahead over there. Let's move backwards. We'll get one of these mountain tiles, but we definitely don't want to be fighting 60,000. And uh, Austria is out of the fight. Nice. Trent will be out as well shortly. I think we just go ahead and drill. Leave you over there. You go over here. And you can go... I think this is a good location. Yeah, definitely. Are oh, you going to walk, aren't you? Oh, you dumb dumb. Go over there. And almost Rome is being converted. So that's going to be lovely. Uh, we've got a buttload of money now. We were going to build a manufactory. Uh, do we do we have anything here for troops? Manpower increases. Um, grain. Actually, that's a good one. Go for it. Hopefully, my audio is uh, is going to be fine. I'm still tinkering with it, so if you have any advice, do let me know. So, let's go drill with my remaining forces. Go. The entire army can just fit into it right now. Uh, we've discovered an agent of Spain. Spain is building up against us. I don't really care. Who are you allied to? Uh, the Papal States. Do we have a truce? We don't. If I declare war on you, Great Britain would join. That's interesting. How about France? Britain would be interested as well. 
And I don't have claims on the uh, areas I would like, and that's the coastal region first. So, going for Spain and Portugal would not be such a bad idea. If we can just start getting all of this, we'll have a large chunk of what we actually need already. However, in four years, the truce with the Ottomans is up. And they are lacking enemies. And I'm kind of hoping that Russia will help me. Oh, actually, they are lacking allies. This is going to be very interesting. We got a bunch of reconquest here. Yeah, we're going to be saving up. Forget about Spain. We're going to be saving up for the war against the Ottomans. So, these guys are going to drill. That's not the best position for you. You go there. Drill. And we're going to take as much manpower as possible. You as well. Drill. We don't need to wor uh, help with that fight anymore. He should be able to do it. Like, we definitely outnumber him quite a bit. He is not making... Ah, oh, man. He's just taking forever. Who are you fighting? The Mamlocks? Oh, this is precisely what I was looking for, actually. We could potentially get the Mamlocks as a vassal. Maybe a forced vassal. We'll have to see. Hungary, there are still troops. We're just going to hide behind our forts. You're drilling. You can drill. Let's see if we can actually take manpower now. Uh, we can almost. 4.6. He's over there. He's over there. Do we need more government houses? Uh, just just a few. We're just stuck on up to the majority of them. Uh, how is this now looking? Yeah, we're inside of a government capacity. So that's going to be nice. Uh, we could take some trade. Production is nice. Anything else? Now, taxation we're not going to look into. Three and a half years now. Thank you. Come on. See, it's trend down. Do you have a claim on him? No. No, I don't. Siege of Trent is done. Let's go... Hide over there. And drill. Yeah, Russia is going to win this. Uh, we don't care about any of this land. All we want... Is coastal territory. And growing our vassals. Because that is going to be rather... Important. I kind of think... I will just take the money in a few. Because we are making quite a bit. If we can just hold this off for a bit. Actually... I don't care about the loyalty. Why would we do that? Uh, Bergs, London, Congo... Eh, no, not really. Let's go drill. How is the army composition right now? So... The combat whip is 30. And we're still on 27. I think we want to get more cannons now. Get the cav out. And get more cannons... Instead of more armies. I kind of like these smaller armies though. They might not be the best, but still. Look at this, man. Russia is doing a great job. 5% on Tunis. All of my troops are drilling. We can now hit this button and we can actually reinforce and start building up again. Three and a half years, that is just too much. Great Britain is without an heir. He is 38. Okay. Why would Keno the third? Go to the throne. I would not approve on that. Spinola. Actually, no, that's my house. Oh, if we can 
take Great Britain as a personal union. Oh my. That would be very, very lovely. Okay, how is... Um, okay, we're six out of six. I could really use, like, diplomacy or perhaps even go for influence. And the reason for influence is... There is vessel annexation time. Here we go. Cost 25%. That would have really helped with this one. And also the March force limit would be good. And maybe we should just not take exploration. We're not really that interested in colonies, right? This is not like we're going to be trying a world conquest or anything. Something about that. Ah, this war is done. Italy, we did 62%. 62%. That is so nice. We got a tiny bit of money. And some truces. Truces are nice. Definitely nice right now. We need to start building up against the elements. Uh, who else were your allies? Poland. I kind of hope that they will break that. They have a lot of troops. Look at that. 281. And we have... Oh, not near those numbers. It's, uh, 148. Poof. That's, uh, that's a big-ass difference. That is a big-ass difference. Not particularly sure if I like that. But at least we're drilling. And we're building up our armies again. And we will need to get more cannons. Because if I declare war on him... Yeah, look at that. They're almost identical. We need more cannons in our armies. Maybe just split them apart and just drill without the cannons. Maybe that will do something. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. Where can I put troops with those kind of numbers? They can go to um, about 49. 55. Oh, there's, 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 there's plenty of where we can actually drop our armies. Especially, like, the capital. Where's my capital again? Oh, here we go. Four, four, uh, 54. So this one's better. Interesting. Um, we want to change this template. Let's start adding more cannons. Let's go... Remove that. Uh, we'll keep the four calf. Um, let's go to 26 to have our front row completely done. And let's start with 20 artillery. Save that. So that's going to be 50. Can I put you down here? No. Uh, let's move you down there and we'll start drilling again. It looks like we are ready to do this, so let's get started on that. Let's get more cannons. You. 42. You need to go there. And we'll start you drilling you. And we'll wait until those cannons are ready. Sweden has a golden era. Great Britain is still without an heir. We... Potentially should build up relations some more with you. Just in case. There's a succession war between Italy and France. Oh god, yes, I would definitely take that. Who would aid you? Province, Hamburg, the Papal States... And I, I definitely hope that that's going to be a glorious war. <gasps> no, you didn't. Ah, oh, damn you, Richard. Damn you. <laughs> um, I'll still improve. Trust. 
truce has expired, which is fine. Keep building that up. Okay, what else can we do? Are there missions, more development missions for us? No, that's just universities. We'll get that eventually. So, is that... Yeah, we just lack... The islands, the Papal States and Venice. We'll get those. So, no more missions for development for us then. I think. No. Oh well. Let's do this. Let's go development and let's go military. Uh, seven is fine. There you go. And we can upgrade to... Oh, that is nice. Uh, we'll get uh, more prestige. Uh, but also the government capacity is now 700. Let's go over here. We are now an empire. And the government capacity is now 900. So that definitely does work out quite well. How is the drilling going? 0.8. Okay, that's definitely not as much as I'd hoped. Are all of your cannons accountable for? Yes. Okay. Uh, let's build up a bit more. How many troops can I still go for? Ah, uh, 200 and... Oh, okay, that's plenty of them. Let's take you. Come on, get out of this fight and prepare to, uh, a few more years for the Ottoman War. Definitely build up that spy network. Byzantium is losing troops. Uh, let's make sure that we get going on this. Are there any buildings I want to go for? Like... Uh, may maybe this one, the local manpower modification. Let's get started on that. Because that will definitely help us with the amount of troops that we'll get. We're now at 1572. Recall the diplomat. How expensive is this? Uh, 250. Yeah, if we can drive that up, that's that's the best. Uh, Catholic Zealots. Where? In Rome. Yeah, I don't really care about that. Um, how many? 13,000. Eh. That's fine. That is fine, mate. I don't care. Conversion was successful. I think that's it for Rome. No, still. He's still working on it. Oh, he's not doing it. Look at that. Yeah, he can't. He is... Okay, um, let's go to province. And we'll go with enforce religious unity. Oh, he's still not doing it. Point four. We need to wait until those Catholic zealots trigger... Can we ex... I would like to provoke them. Okay, 1.5. Oh, wait. Keep drilling. Don't want to move about my forts. Come on, Russia, you can do this. There we go. Way to go, dude. Way to go. Um, he actually got Poland out. Did you break your alliance with him? No, you didn't. Oh, that's a, that's not the smartest move. Definitely not the best. So, they still clearly outnumber us. 
Are they going to help? Wait a minute. Not sure how the man looks looking. Devastated, yeah. Ah, come on, finish this war. I want to see what is left of um, of the Mamluks after this. I don't care about that. We're still above in power projection, so we can just lay low a bit and keep drilling for our manpower. There yeah, is one of those buildings done. 1651. This one's nice. 250. Definitely those. We have to keep on going with that. Come on, man. Get out of this this war, please. And keep building up. Let's build some more troops. Because we do need to prepare. So we got about... That's going to be 170. We lost claims in Spain. Eh, we'll, we'll get Spain later. We don't need to do this right now. Because, like I said, the Ottomans first. They are the biggest threat. Or threat, or whatever. Let's get all the tech. And we're almost to national uh, sovereignty at 18. So that's going to be nice. Uh, I've not decided yet on what to do. We already have two military ideas, and... Ah, man, what to take. What to take. Like, this is not really helping us right anymore. At least, not right now. I don't use that many mercenaries. Humanists... What will it do for us? What, what, what would it do for us? Yearly prestige plus 0.5 and prestige decay negative 1. Land leader shock plus 1. Idea cost negative 10 and institution spread negative 20. That's not that great actually. How about admin? Manpower recovery speed plus 15. Land maintenance modifier plus 5. So that's just money. Trade efficiency plus 20. That's interesting. Expansion. Land fire. No. Trade efficiency. Trade steering. Land force limit modifier. Global settler increase. We're not having settlers. Morale of army. Yeah, morale of army is good. And it's in two different things. Because we can get the one with the quality ideas. Morale of armies plus 5. Siege ability plus 10. And we get the morale of armies plus 10. And the recover man uh, power. Morale. How about innovativeness? Never take this. Infantry combat ability. I'm actually... We might just go for religious. But first things first. Influence. I think influence is the one that we want. Although getting a additional diplomatic relation would be nice. Yeah, we'll go for influence. I think that would benefit us the most. Income from vessels is not that important. We have it on two ideas. Attrition for enemies. Land force limit modifier. Maybe we should go Diplo. Monthly war exhaustion. Diplomatic reputation. Yeah, we should... No, okay, we'll go diploma Diplo. Once we get 18. So, it, that, that's not there yet. That is not there yet. Let's keep building up our money. Building up our manpower. We got two. Why are you not drilling? You have no leader. Drill. Drill, drill, drill. Keep drilling. Nobody cares for that one point. That was dumb. I should have kept looking into that. 2.88. Yeah, that's nice. I want to have as much as possible. Because... We do need to reinforce against the Ottomans. Can we... Threaten Poland to break... 
alliance with the Ottomans? No. Can we... This is their last hold, right? From Venice? No, they're not. Oh, could we... Threaten you with war? Okay, we have a truce, so we can't do that. Papal States? No. Uh, we are at war. That's the big issue. Okay, come on, uh, Russia. They're, they're done. They're completely dead. Stop this damn war. Okay, that's the one we were looking for. Uh, the fort is maintained, so there's, there's no real rush into this. Just... Great advice died. Oh, speaking of which, we'll have to look into that. Uh, I should be able to level him up. National unrest. Missionary... Oh, wait a minute. We can take missionary strength... Let's level you up. Morale of armies. Let's take a look. Uh, army composition. Rivals. Like, my morale is quite high. Like, they have a really low morale. Why? Craven. Oh, their ruler is horrible. And I'm going to keep my discipline guy because it looks like... We are doing very well against him. Never mind. We'll keep the discipline. Um, are we able to... Okay. Uh, let's wait for that one month. Like I said, don't want to lose too many troops. And go send you in there. Uh, we'll drill over here. Let's see. Oh, yeah, we're doing it. We are converting Rome. The way it should be. <laughs> uh, 3.2. Okay, that's nice. Uh, we're now 4 out of 4 leaders, so that's good. If we want... No, I kind of want to keep developing my military. We are... Yeah, we definitely are still focused on military. And we're going to be leveling these guys up. Especially the Diplo guy. Uh, Morocco raided our shores again. Bastard. And there is the, uh, the truce with the Ottomans. I need Russia to get out of this right now. No longer a valid rival. Are you still alive? Yes, you are. It's a damn shame. Let's take a look. There is no one that um, would work. Oh, well. Uh, anyways, guys, that's it for now. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And next time, I'm sure that Russia will end this war with Lithuania. And I think that's the timing we've been looking for to, um, to go and fight the Ottomans. It's going to be scary, definitely scary battles, and the annexation of Tunis is going to take forever. Here's the Memlooks. Could you stop sulking? If I declare war on you... If he completely disappears right now, we can release the Ottomans, give him territory back, or annexing Tunis, release the Ottoman, or the Memlooks, and we'll have a lot of claims on the, uh, the Ottomans. That's what we'll do, probably. Anyways, have a good one. Bye-bye.